Okay. Hey, what's up? What's up? What's up? Welcome to my channel, Journey to Soul. My name is Z. What is up, everybody? I am doing a quick channel message here for the collective, okay? We are still in Pisces season. I hope all is swell. Please like, subscribe, and share if you like the message and it resonates, okay? Cool. Yes, um, Pisces season here, okay? We're just going to get um, a spread or two on the common theme, the common um, commonality. <laughs> In regards to lies and gossip here, okay? Lies, gossip, jealousy, betrayal, okay? Sex, scandals, okay? Thieves. Um, but mainly gossip and lies here. Because you have to understand that people who gossip, people who lie, they gossip and lie to other people like them. Okay. Um, it's a, it's a low vibration. When you're gossiping, it's a low vibration here because you're wasting time. You're wasting time. Um, especially in this day and age, like you have to really be, take a pause, uh, before you give energy to certain people or certain things, because especially in this day of age, um, where time is so precious, time is money. Time is money because there's so many ways to make money here. So you really have to take a pause um, and kind of think of who you're dealing with and the mind state that they're in here. Okay. Because it gets deep. It gets deep because people tell horrible lies, atrocious here. Okay. Uh, with the, the intent, uh, with the purpose to defame you, to make you lose here. Okay, to make you give up hope here, to make you, sh to shame you in a sense here. Um, and you have to remember, these people are shameful. Uh, people who lie and gossip, they're unhappy with their lives. Okay, very unhappy. Now, I immediately heard, um, I immediately heard that, you know, these people, they have things. They have things. Um, some, a lot of these people, they have a lot of material gain, possibly even wealth. But there's this mind state here. There's, there's this obsession um, with you for whatever reason here. Okay. So yeah, it's a common. I mean, it's in every reading here, and it's a karmic energy here. Okay, with the lies and gossips, and you have to understand that. Nobody's an angel here. Okay, I'm not talking about, okay, you get together with your, your girlfriends once in a blue moon and y'all have some old gossip here about, <laughs> you know, high school or college or work. I'm talking about, again, people who spread lies and rumors with the intent to hurt, okay, with the intent to uh, defame you in a sense here, okay? Uh, it's a very extremely uh, low vibrational here because, you know, what we see here is there's, you know, the, you know, the, <laughs> the narcissistic level here um, that you're dealing with um, in the unseen realm is it's, un it's unreal. It's unreal because what you have is you'll have someone who you have to say there's no judgment here. Um, there is no judgment here. We can't be putting ourselves in a position where we are judging others here. Okay. But the problem comes where, for instance, if you sell sex here, okay, that's how you get by. That's how you get yours. You've chose your lot in life. Okay. But you can't be selling sex here. Uh, for your bins here, okay, for your your home here, and then turn around and try to defame a person, a male or a female here, that is maybe working a nine to five and drives a Kia or a Hyundai. Like, see, that's where the problem comes in at. That's where the problem comes in because it's not what you do. It's how you do it. 
So um, that's why you're seeing a lot of narcissists just on the the uprise here, okay? Um, because again, you can't you can't be out here not taking care of your own flesh and blood, okay? You can't be a deadbeat out here and then run around lying and gossiping about the mother of your children, okay? About your ex-wife, okay? About someone else's, you know, household. You know, and that's what you see out here. People who are guilty as hell projecting their feelings onto you. That's what you see in the cards every day, every day. Um, you know, when people have this backlash, when it comes to rejection, uh, when they have this nastiness, this ugliness, um, you know, that's, that stems from a, some type of childhood trauma or wound. A lot of the times here. Okay. And, 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 and then it, again, it's the thing of, we all have some type of trauma, some type of wound, some type of unhealed wounds. Okay. But you can't turn around and project onto other people. You have people lying, people who have deadly STDs. Lying, saying that someone else has it. Like, you got to be kidding me. This is the type of shit that we see here. Okay? This is the type of shit that goes on. Like, it's one thing. And there's so much, there's already a stigma. There's already a shame around people who have contracted a deadly STD. But when you have these people that refuse to heal, refuse to look in their mirror, um, just refuse to accept, their, um, accept the consequences here. Okay. And again, still, we can't even judge that. If you're going to be in the energy of not, not acceptance, that's fine. But the problem, the true, true problem for you, where the karma really, really, really is fucking you up at is where you go out and you try to say that someone else has a deadly STD and you're the one walking around with it. That's a negative. That's a fucking negative. It's not what you do, it's how you do it. Like, people are out here burying themselves for no fucking reason. Like, it's one thing here to lose yourself in a relationship here or go through a breakup here or a split up or a divorce, okay? Um, because you cheated. But hey, uh, a lot of people cheat. I mean, it happens. People have split up, they have breakups, they have divorces. But then when you try to go out and about and spread lies and rumors and say that somebody else was at fault, that's a negative. That's a fucking negative. Like, this is the shit that I see here um, in my spreads here, okay, in my messages here, you know? Um, every now and then you see somebody... Like it, it's just become like, again, it's, it's, it's a lot of narcissistic, um, energy floating around. Okay. Like people don't want to take a L and we all have to take L's <laughs> like they don't want to take an L. Not only do they not want to take an L, they want to put up a front, like they're not taking an L and then they want to put lies and gossip on you and say that you're taking an L. And it's like, in the end of the day, you don't give a fuck. Because again, you have to stand. birds of a feather flock together, okay? A fool can't go up to a man that's running two and three businesses here, okay? A man that's working to provide for his family. Someone who has his shit together here, okay? Um, someone who is looking to leave generational wealth for their great-great-grandchildren. Like, a fool can't go up to this person and talk about the tea. Motherfuckers don't want to hear that. They looking at you like you crazy. Like, well, where's the money? So 
you know, that's the thing about it. You always have to remember that part. Again, like these people, they have to lie and gossip to other people who are accepting of that energy. When you have your eyes on the prize, you, you, don't, you don't have time for lies and gossip. It's low vibrational. Anything that's low vibrational fucks up your money. So that's the other thing, because the first thing you do when you confront these narcissists, they want to throw material things in your face, but it doesn't last. And you know, it's not going to last because of the low vibrational energy that they dwell in. And it's so crazy. It's so crazy here. It's just like this, this new, I'm sorry, new age. I don't know what the fuck is going on. All right, well, we're just going to get into a spread or two, okay? Mm -hmm. Pisces season and shit is getting deep. Shit is getting deep here, okay? Shit is getting really deep here. Um, let's pull one or two of mine and then we'll get into a spread here, okay? And so we can get confirmation here. A lot going on, okay? Karmic bond and a precious child. Okay. Precious children, karmic bond here. Mm -hmm. People are lying, doing all of this scandal. And, and at the end of the day, the children are the future here. <laughs> like people out here, they have these karmic bonds. They're creating these karmic bonds here. People could even be creating karmic bonds with precious children here. Like, we don't know what the fuck is going on here, okay? Yeah. Go forth, be bold just came out. Mm-hmm. Okay, we're going to keep that out. Let's pull a couple more before we get into spread. What is this? Okay. <laughs> There's the confirmation. The narcissist. What's behind here? Ooh. Dirty official. Inside job. Okay. And then gang stalking. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Like, and then, and then that's so funny. The people who they lie and they gossip about you, but they got to watch you to see what you're doing here. <laughs> okay. Like again, extremely unhappy, extremely unhappy here. Like ain't no way I'm going to spend time watching you because that shit don't pay. And again, you have to take a pause before you even respond to these people. Okay, and, and try to <laughs> grasp their way of thinking and viewing the world. You can't because they're lunatics here. All right, let's let's, let's keep going. We're gonna get a couple more of mine. So far, we have karmic bond, precious children, go forth, be bold, gang stalking, the narcissist, and dirty official. Okay, inside job here. Mm, 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 mm. Mm -mm. So you have a narcissist with power here, okay? Ooh, ooh, toxic family at the bottom of the deck. Divine feminine, okay? Earth, okay? Someone could be an, um, an earth sign here, okay? Could be an earth sign, divine feminine here. Yeah, yeah, we did have toxic family coming out. What's behind divine feminine? Ooh, God is real. I said, what is behind divine feminine? God is real. Ooh, mm -mm -mm. Something else here. All right, we're just going to get straight into the tarot. And then we out, okay? Because it's not much to say. It's not much to say, but you just see it so much here. You just see it so much. And like this timeline, it goes on and on. On and on, it's never ending because someone does not want to um, lay in the bed that they made. Too bad. Okay. And again, we're not, we're not, we shouldn't put ourselves in a place to judge. But you can't turn around and lie on people. That's not what we're doing. It's not what we're doing. It's not what we're doing. Okay. Three of Wands energy here. Okay. Six of Swords here. Someone's going to be moving on. All right. Yeah, page of wands. Someone is going to be moving on. You could even be moving to a new home here. Okay, page of cups energy here. Okay. All right. Could have been something manifested here. Okay. 
five of wands with the six of swords. Yeah, they, they, they want to apologize. But they want to fight too. <laughs> uh -uh. Okay, what is this? Okay, seven of coins with the six of coins here. Okay. King of wands at the bottom of the deck. Two of wands at the top of the deck here. Someone could be dealing with a fire sign here. A lot of fire energy here. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, someone, they want to have an exchange here in the future here. They're still, they're still here. Okay. I don't know if you're dealing with this person. There's a king of wands that wants to come in here. Okay. I feel like you were waiting on this person in the past, possibly here. To make a decision, it could have been. They're telling me. With the Six of Wands energy, like this person thought they were all that. Like I said, it doesn't have to be a fire sign here. Seven of Coins with the Six of Coins here. But now someone wants to invest here um, and have some type of exchange here. Oop, the devil. I'd be damned. Part of the deck and the devil. Thanks, but no thanks. Could be dealing with the Capricorn here, okay? Okay. karmic bonds okay uh, strength card okay could be dealing with a leo here um but there's a battle here because we have the devil and then we have strength okay top of the deck we have knight of swords yeah trying to come in fast here okay uh be weary of someone trying to come in quick trying to come in fast okay Okay, what is this? Yeah, Ten of Wands here. Okay, Four of Cups, <laughs> Knight of Coins, and the Five of Wands. This person ain't shit here. Okay? Trying to disrupt your peace and your happiness here. You're having a tea party. Mm -hmm. They're trying to flood the place. What is going on? Okay. Someone wants to get you all wrapped up in your emotions here, but someone is coming in heavy. They're dissatisfied with life or their lot in life here okay um and again they're toxic with the five of wands energy they want to fight here okay okay but they can't really catch you they're lagging behind with the nine of coins energy here queen of cups with the ten of cups energy here yeah they want some yeah you're extremely happy here with the sun card okay interesting mm -mm. like <laughs> uh uh I just feel like you're peeping from behind the rainbow like who is that okay let's keep it moving doing just fine all right rainbows all about God's plan God's promise here okay the hermit energy here okay yeah doing just fine by yourself Virgo energy here okay eight of swords at the bottom of the deck yeah with the king of cups energy here okay with the hermit and the eight of swords energy and the queen of cups okay now this could have been a situation um or relationship in which you were really locked in with someone in the past okay like you had a, a, a real tight bond with this person here. Okay. Um, but you guys are, I feel like someone is coming out of period, coming out of a period of isolation here. Because you have the Hermit, the Eight of Swords is coming up in past energy here. Now you could have been blind to a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpio here. Okay. Yep. Three of Swords with the Eight of Swords energy here. Blind as a bat. Not going to be here long here, okay? Not going to be here long. Like I said, um, confirmation. Okay, the higher fit energy here. Mm -hmm. The higher fit energy came out when I said that. Nine of swords energy here, yeah. Someone thought they had you. Someone thought they had you in the bag here. Okay, someone thought they ruled you. They thought they controlled you here. Yeah, with the will of fortune energy here. Okay. Like someone knew you were the ticket here. Okay, they knew you were the prize. They knew it.
Okay. They knew it. Ace of Swords energy here. Okay. Okay, Two of Cups energy here with the Ten of Coins. Mm, 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 mm. The Emperor. Last spread. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, the Devil. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Someone was like ringing you dry like a towel here. Okay, with the Eight of Swords, the Devil, and the Wheel of Fortune coming out here with the Nine of Cups energy here. Yeah, and the Empress energy. Mm -hmm. Could have been a third-party situation here. Um, but someone was draining you, um, finances, emotionally and mentally here. Okay? Interesting. All right, well, that has been a reading here. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching my channel, Journey to Soul. Bye.